Hello, this is Raymond Mayfield, and it's great to be coming to you on this broadcast today. And I appreciate your blessings on the spiritual warfare and the armor of God. I'm going to conclude this session here by this message today. And the last uh, thought is going to be on prayer. But in my last session, we talked about the sword of the Spirit, which is the Word of God. The Word of God makes us aware of all of Satan's devices and tricks. And believe me, he has a lot of tricks and he has a lot of devices, but God has the antidote for it and God knows how to take care of every one of his tricks. Paul talks about prayer in my last message today and the subject of warfare. We could look up on prayer as another weapon we can use, but I see it more as a duty a Christian should have a duty and enjoy prayer and enjoy the benefits of prayer and knowing that God does hear and answer prayer. Ephesians 6 and 18 kind of wraps up uh, the message on warfare and all the things to do. And then he tells us, praying always with all prayer and supplication in the spirit and watching thereunto with all perseverance and supplication for all the saints. That tells us to be praying always. Now, we've got to be in a spirit of prayer all the time. You know, we've got jobs to do. We've got work to do. We just can't go around praying all the time. But we're to be in a spirit of prayer and to pray at every chance we get. And with supplication, and we're to pray in the spirit. That is deep intercessory prayer that we get along with God and require to God watching thereunto with all perseverance, and we need to watch with perseverance and supplication for all the saints, not just for ourselves, but for everyone else. This means praying on every occasion and every season. It means even praying when we don't even feel like it. With all entreated to keep alert and to watch for strong purpose and perseverance interceding for all of God's people. And we have, not because, we have not because we have asked not, the Word of God tells us. Praying whether we feel like it or not is a good way to, to determine that. And when we intercede for other people and God blesses it, and great things happen when we pray. Praying before we make an important decision. Praying before you decide to marry someone or, or making a decision on who you're going to spend a lifetime with. We need to pray. With a lot of determination, we should not pray selfishly, but for other people. And I hope you all have enjoyed these series of messages on the armor of God. And I'll be talking to you again real